Let's now get a check on the weather conditions in Korea and around the world with our Kelly Park standing by. Good morning, Kelly. Hello, Isan, and good morning. We start the new work week with the weather looking pretty unsettled. Now, many of you who are getting back on your Monday morning routines and heading to work and school will need to carry out a small umbrella before you head out. Uh, right now, we have widespread of scattered showers across the entire nation, but it'll only fall during the morning hours, while some areas in the west central regions, including Seoul, have already cleared up. Now, we will become mostly to partly cloudy and somewhat breezy today, but other than that, temperatures will be pretty mild with a few showers popping up later this evening in the central area. Now tomorrow, skies will remain partly cloudy throughout the day with mild temperatures to enjoy. But there will be a slight amount of yellow dust blowing in some regions with a possible chance of more rain later in the evening. Now, similar conditions will be in place till Wednesday, but temperatures will slightly drop lower than the seasonal averages for the remainder of this week. Now, moving over to our satellite map, the low pressure front will gradually move out of the country, but the central region will be influenced by another weak pressure system, seeing a few scattered showers later this evening. And finally, checking out um, today's readings. Morning lows start off pretty high today. Seoul starts off at 6 degrees and rises up to 14 in the afternoon. Daegu and Gwangju both begins at 9 and reaches up to 19 and 16 degrees respectively, while Busan sees a high at 13 degrees. Now, other regions like Jeju Island will see some rain in the morning hours. Daejeon clears up with a high at 16 and Mount Gyeongbyeon will be topping out at 14 degrees. And that's all for Korea and for viewers around the world. Here's the international weather.